a cup of knowledge. I am still an infancy in this world of words, still feeding from the breast of the best wordsmiths and linguists. Blessed to share a stage once occupied by seasoned chanteuse who educated me on coming a page. I listen and absorb the skill of the tongue spoon that stirs my pot of music and serves up a steaming bowl of enlightenment. I ingest musical chords, lyrical swords, manifestations of times come and gone, jovial anecdotes about well-worn leather pants and psychedelic coats, stories of war and soldiers no more, political frustration on how the hell we got Mother Earth into this deadly situation. Chinatown, drugs going down, a lot of playful, playful flirting, green leather pants making them drool. Hey Michael, buddy, thank you for introducing me to the school, the school of three cups. Whoa. not going to be what even I think I am five minutes after I finish reading this. I am the unexpected little zing of lime on chipotle tortilla chips that provokes your palate with a sensual joke. I am the warm, gooey, creamy, smooth caramel on the bottom of your ice cream sundae. I am the nutrient-rich pot liquor that everyone wants to ladle over their mashed potatoes. <laughs> I am the feeling of deja vu you get when you're walking down the street and get a whiff of that familiar scent that makes you feel all warm and squishy inside. But you can't remember where you know it from. You just know it makes you feel so good. I am your first real French kiss, awakening feelings and aches and parts of you that make you feel dirty and slippery. <laughs> I am the shock glass filled with reckless abandon, gulp in one motion that opens the door to wavy carelessness and broken promises. I am the raw truth that hurts you to your core, but gives you the strength you needed to overcome that seemingly insurmountable deed. I am the boss lady in total charge and control who doesn't have a clue what to do next. I am the clown with the big red smile painted on the permanent lacerations in her heart, body, and spirit. I am that piece of precious art buried in the insecurities of her mother that only a true aficionado will take the time to excavate for. I am that superhero named Captain save a who believes even God loves a sinner. I am the stereotype who entertains no form of stereotypical rhetoric. I am the glowing source of infinite life-giving energy that has been totally raped of all she has, yet is still forced to produce. I am everything, nothing, something. I am misunderstood, overlooked, underestimated, and too much to be ignored because I am the gatekeeper. So sweet thing, come talk to me. Oh, wow. yeah.